Shalom, shalom, Shabbat shalom. Today is May 18, 2019. This is a King Priest and I'm coming to you today um, just to talk to you about 2020, the number 2020. Uh, this number is significant because it's double, it's a double number. Uh, first, I want to go to the number two. I want to go over the number two. All right, the number two, uh, the number two usually falls in the legal realm. So number two is, it falls in the legal realm. It has to do with law, okay? Now, in, the, in, in news, we've been hearing a lot of things about the Constitution. The Constitution is in jeopardy. Well, two is the principle uh, number when it comes to law because you have to have two or more witnesses to testify against somebody you know by two or more uh, miles speak let everything be established uh, that's the law but here we have 2020 which is 20 has to do with redemption that's another legal thing redemption redemption that's another legal thing so 20 has to do with redemption um yeah 20 has to do with redemption uh if you look in the scriptures like from uh from genesis to leviticus or or, or nahum let's uh, from Genesis to Numbers, if we look from Genesis to Numbers, I'm sorry, Salakia, from Genesis to Number, it talks about law. It talks about military, okay? It talks about military. So you got three things going on here: law, military, and redemption. All right. Law, military, and redemption. Those are the three things. Now, 19 is judgment. Uh, so you know we in we in the time of judgment right now. That's why you see all the hurricanes, the tsunamis, and earth, and you know people getting shot down in the street. You know many people think that is just going on just because. No, this, this is judgment time. Why are you seeing a heightened thing of this judgment time? Um, so we have illegal battles now. Now they're talking about abortion. That's both law and uh law that's that's law and that's uh, military because you know you're killing someone in the womb that that's uh that's an unjust unjust act you know there's variations in between it but it's unjust just acts you shouldn't do it at all it should be the last resort um that you should do it shouldn't even be done at all uh that's just me speaking uh you know because i believe that the most high is able to provide for all so we have 2020 which is law, military, and redemption, okay? Now, uh, the shekel is a unit in the weight and the measure, okay? And one shekel is 28 grams, okay? Or, or one ounce. No, no, I'm sorry. One shekel is 10 grams, okay? And two shekels will e equal up to one ounce of silver. Okay, I'm bringing this up because we're having legal battles where the scales have to be rebalanced. Okay, uh, the black horse is riding, so the scales have to be rebalanced. How is the scales rebalanced? Is is rebalanced? Excuse my finger. Is rebalanced through law, through military, and redemption. Okay, redemption meaning that uh, restitution has to be paid for certain things that have, have been done. Okay, and it has to be balanced so that. Uh, what is being paid will be a just weight and a just measure. Um, now we know that man is supposed to live up to 120 years. 20 years, that's what the most I say. Man live up to 120 years. Um, again, redemption, okay? We're not gonna go into the 100, I'm just gonna talk on 20 right now. Uh, most of the time when you see um, Anything in Genesis to Numbers is talking about law. A man up to uh, up to twenty. Uh, everybody can be numbered um, from five to twenty. Okay, 
five years old up to 20 can be numbered. And anybody over 20 can go into military. I know in America it's 18, but anybody over 20 can go into the military. Again, that's another thing when it comes to law, military, and redemption. This is why we're in that season. And this is why I'm telling people to buy you some so that you can be just you so that you can preserve your wealth as the scales being rebalanced and as the scales are being rebalanced and being redeemed you know all the all the stealing that has been done by the wicked and the rulers when that's being redeemed you can't have a just unjust weight you know because they can pay you you know they'll pay you a hundred dollars a day and tomorrow that hundred dollars will be worth five cents you know um it's already worth two cents now so you don't want that worthless paper so you have to redeem your uh, wages in lawful money okay lawful money is gold and silver coins that's the, that's the only money there is everything else is credit all right or debt that's that's all his people pay piece so um in exodus 30 and 13 it says this they shall give every one that passeth among them that are numbered half a shekel after the shekel of the sanctuary. A shekel is 20 garage and a half shekel shall be the offering of the most high. Okay. So like I said, a shekel is uh, 10 grams and a half shekel will be 5 grams. Okay. That's easy enough. And a garage would be 0 0.05, be small as a bean, it'd be a little sprinkle of silver. You know what I mean? It's, it's a dime, pretty much. Well, it's, it's probably a, less than a dime, but the size of a dime. You know, I was just backward with a nickel is bigger than a dime. Um, but nonetheless, still. So I just wanted to get that out there, get that teaching out there, so you know that uh, right now silver is at $14. So if it's at $14, if you had 2.5 grams, that would be $4.64. Um, let's see, 2.5, 2.54 grams. Actually, 2.54 grams is $1.17. All right, and... Uh, 10 grams is four dollars and 61 cent give or take the spot uh give or take your spot and 28 grand three cents really 14 dollars you know but you got to give the leeway you know if you bought it and trade it the, the spot price is 14 but you know somebody might want to make a little extra money so you might take off a dollar or 50 cent or whatever so that's called the spread or spot uh into a price spread that's the price there's some leeway where you can barter with them in that price. You know, I usually do 5%, which is the best thing. You know, 5% discount off a of, of spot price, you know. Um, but that's all for that. I hope you be blessed on this Shabbat. Shabbat Shalom. Get yourself some gold and some silver. Lionite Trust. You can go, you can hit the link um, in the bottom to get your paperwork in order. Become a secure party creditor. Learn how to save uh, preserve your wealth I can show you different strategies of doing that but nonetheless it's time to prepare for war get right with the most high read your red words and repent for the kingdom shalom shalom